In this video, I want to introduce you to the concept of inline editing in Drupal. Take your cursor and hover over the title, and on the right hand side, you'll see a pencil. These are all contextual, so if I hover over the title, it's going to ask me to configure the block. Click on Configure Block, and the block is actually the general block for page title. So I'm going to encourage you, don't change this simply because you will change the way page titles are on every node. So let's leave that one alone. Go back to the site, hover over the pencil here, and again you get to configure the block and change the tabs that might be shown. Once again, I'm going to encourage you to leave this one completely alone, but I wanted to show it to you so you'd know what it was. Click back to site. Finally, click on the pencil in the content area, and you'll have three. Quick Edit, Edit, and Delete. Quick Edit is front-end editing in an inline window. Edit takes us straight back to the main editing window for a node, and of course, Delete deletes the node after you've confirmed that. Go ahead and click on Quick Edit. And now you can edit your node right here in an inline fashion. As I hover, it takes me to the different sections of the individual node, and all I need to do is to click. And now I can add more content. I can view the source. I can even bold some text. Once I've made a change, Drupal asks me to save. Go ahead and click Save, and now my node is updated. If I go into an article node, so let's go into Welcome to Drupalville so we can see how that works, go ahead and click on Quick Edit, and you'll notice that the title and the body field are editable here in the front end, but the image is not. In order to edit your image, you'll need to actually go into the edit screen to update the image. But once again, I can make changes to my body and click Save. I can also edit the tags in the Quick Edit window. And so the front end editing in Drupal is actually great for quick edits, but not for complex edits and not for images. Normally, you'll just go ahead and click on the Edit tab, and then you can update your content right here in the administration side of your Drupal website. This is a fantastic feature of Drupal. For quick edits, it's really, really handy.